The horses are on the track for race number one. They're going to go seven furlongs for $11,500. Number one is Commander McDivitt, owned and trained by Jerry Gorno, Richard Mangley aboard. Number two is Big Egypt, owned by Garth Grider and Violetta Adamchuk, trained by Jared Brown with Rico Walcott. Number three is Plum Lucky, owned by Marvin and Deb Buffalo, trained by Marvin Buffalo with Rafael Zentino Jr. Number four is Honor Road, Owned by All In Racing Stable, trained by Tiffany Husbands with Wilmer Galvez. Number five, that's Valid Thor. Owned by Henry Witt Jr., trained by Jerry Gorno with Nyrone Austin. Rounding out the field is number six, Ten's Legacy. Owned by Pierre Gagne, trained by Sean Morin with Neville Stevenson. Early daily double wagering here in race number one. They go to post in four minutes. The field is set, they're at post. And they're off. On a road, out of the gate quickly. And straight out to the early lead. Restrained on the outside in second, that's Ten's Legacy. Commander McDivitt having a little trouble on the rail, but is sitting well in third. Fourth on the outside, that's going to be Valid Thor. Then it's another length back to Big Egypt and Plum Lucky. Racing as a pair at the back of the field. The opening quarter, a sluggish 26 and 2. And Honor Road has it all his own way by a length. Ten's Legacy still patient. On the outside in second, Commander McDivitt. Moving up the rail in third with Valid Thor to his outside. And the two trailers running as a pair, Big Egypt and Plum Lucky, only have four lengths to make up the half 51 and two. Ten's Legacy now pulls the trigger and goes by on a road by a head. On a road still fighting back with Mort Offer in second. Commander McDivitt stalled on the rail in third. Valid Thor trying to rally from the outside. Ten's Legacy, now with the lead, coming to the 16th pole, and looking strong, Ten's Legacy is going to win by a length and a half, on a road is second best, third's going to go to Plum Lucky, and fourth to Valid Thor. Now entering the winner's enclosure is the official winner here in race number one, that's number six, Ten's Legacy. Ten's Legacy is a big gelding, four years old by Milwaukee Brill, out of the mare 1030 by Corinthian. Owned by Pierre Gagne, trained by Sean Morin, and ridden to victory by Neville Stevenson. Time for the seven furlongs, 128 and 3. Race one is official in the upcoming second race. There are no changes. Post time for race number two, 18 minutes away. <laughs> 